In this video I will be showing you guys how to get unlaunch working on your DSi. So for this to work you must already have the homebrew channel on your DSi. If you don't have that make sure to go and watch my homebrew channel video. I'll leave a link to that in the description. But anyway make sure we just go and get our DSi's SD card. We need to connect this to our computer. So go and connect it now and I will show you what to do from there. So on your PC, getting unlaunch is very simple. You want to go to the link in the description. This is the DSi custom firmware guide. You want to scroll down and you just want to click on unlaunch right here. And what this will do is download the unlaunch zip file. So once we've got that in our downloads folder, go to your downloads folder and simply find it. Um, go into the zip file, just double click on it. And we're looking for a file. We need to find this, the unlaunch.dsi. So just drag that out to your downloads folder. And basically what we need to do is we need to rename this. So right click, go to rename. And what we want to call it is unlaunch.nds so I'm just going to type it in again but it's unlaunch.nds at the end and then press enter and then just click on yes you also must have file extensions enabled so if you click on view and um, this one here where it says file name extensions make sure that is turned on so you can see where it says .nds at the end and there you go, it's as simple as that. We can now drag and drop it on the root of our DSi's SD card. Wait for it to copy across and there you go. So let's go back onto our DSi and let's set up unlaunch. Okay, so once we're back off our computer, the first thing you want to do is just go and put your SD card back into your DSi. Alright, so on your DSi, the first thing you want to do is obviously just load up the homebrew channel. So we're just going to go and load up our camera. Then we just need to go and open up the album. So just open the album and then you should just boot into it and what we're going to do is we're going to scroll down and we're going to load up unlaunch so here is unlaunch press a on it and it will start up just like this so it looks kind of weird it's got like a front of a boat on it or something but what you actually want to do is scroll down to where it says install now and you just want to press a on this now it's just going to install and it's going to say installation complete. It should install in a few seconds. Once that's done, just press A again and we can actually just scroll down to power down and press A on this. This is just going to power off your DSi. Now the next time we actually press the power button to power it back on, it's actually going to power us straight into unlaunch and it pretty much looks like this. You can see we've got no cartridge. Um, you can even go into the launcher and you can press A to like, load it up and there you go. That is how you get unlaunched on your DSi. We can now install um, a custom firmware. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this quick video. Um, I'll probably make the custom firmware video soon. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.